someone had told me three years ago I'd be standing up here today in front of all my family and friends marrying the love of my life, I would have laughed. I was never the girl that pictured what her wedding day looked like. It wasn't until I met you that I was actually able to envision this day, and it's been more magical than I ever could have dreamed it to be. The love you have for your friends and family warms my heart, and when I look around the room, I can feel the love that everyone has here for you. You're the most genuine, hardworking, caring man I've ever met. And even though you bug me sometimes, <laughs> I am honestly the luckiest girl in the world to be able to call you my husband. I promise to always be by your side no matter what life throws at us. I promise I will try to remember there is more than one way of getting things done, even though my way is probably the right way. And I promise not to bother you too much during football Sundays and when the Leaf game is on, including the intermissions. Who knew those were important too? <laughs> Thank you for choosing to love me. I love you. After high school, we always all used to get together and we go out to Tim's for coffee and we would just spend hours sitting and chatting and telling old stories like we we're a bunch of old men already. Uh, and since then, our lives have gotten a lot more busy. Uh, they're about to get even more busy, but I know that there will be a time when we actually are old men and we're sitting there reminiscing about all the great things that are just about to happen to you guys. So I'm excited for you two to build on what you've already started, and I feel really fortunate to be a part of it. I love you guys. Because at the time Nicole met BJ she had just bought a house she was done waiting for a guy to show up she was a strong independent woman who didn't need a man little did she know her Prince Charming was right around the corner guess you can say a dream is a wish the heart makes just goes to show life happens when you least expect it I look forward to seeing what this next chapter has in store for you both so let's raise a glass to the new Mr. and Mrs. Trush. I love you both and wish you all the happiness life has to offer. Cheers. I still remember Nicole going on her first date with you on a good Friday three or four years ago. Some months later, you were still dating and she wanted us to meet you. We liked you immediately. You were friendly, easy to talk to, and quite the cutie. I love that you were a Leaf fan and had an instant connection. When you asked Nicole to move in with you, we knew that things were becoming more serious. But when you came and asked me for Nicole's hand in marriage, we knew you were the one that we wanted her to spend the rest of her life with.
BJ and Nicole, remember to be kind to each other as you continue this life's journey together. Be patient and understanding. Don't forget to communicate, laugh, and have fun. This is a great recipe for a long, happy, and successful marriage. Oh yes, and BJ, it is true. Happy wife, happy life. Party raged on, you could only hear the bass thump With two empty cups, my heart it all came pouring out Yeah, white Russian, just let me be a boy sky And when I'm gone, do you think about me? Since you came back, I see things differently And this love came so easily We were talking in the dark, but it's so clear to me Our advice to you both is to always remember what made you choose each other. Fight when necessary and get it out of your system. Don't let it fester. But most of all, respect each other and your differences. They will become your marriage strengths. We know, Nicole, that as a family, we're a lot to handle. But we feel you're up to the challenge because we all love you and we welcome you officially today into the Trush family with open arms. And Nicole, remember, now there are three of us. Three Mrs. Trushies. <laughs> Over the last couple weeks, a lot of people have asked me if I was nervous about today. And my answer was always no. Nicole, you're without question the best thing that's ever happened. You look absolutely amazing in your dress, and I can't believe how lucky I am to call you my wife. I've never really put too much stock into the cliche, better half. But when you find someone that makes everything in your life better, you quickly realize that that cliche is true. Together, we really do bring out the best in each other, and I honestly don't know what I'd do without you. I love you more than watching football on Sundays. I love you more than Pearl Jam. And yes, I think I love you more than the Toronto Maple Leafs.